Putin is in a hurry and is trying to throw all his resources into the war. Former advisor to the U.S. Secretary of State, former director for European and Eurasian Affairs at the U.S. National Security Council, Matthew Breizer, said that Russian leader Vladimir Putin is trying to achieve as many results as possible on the battlefield before an important date for him, the U.S. elections in November. I'm not sure that they represent a specific deadline for him, but Putin really hopes that if Donald Trump wins, Ukraine will be forced to sit down at the negotiating table with the Russian Federation and accept his conditions. From his point of view, after Donald Trump becomes US president, support for Ukraine will decrease significantly. Accordingly, this will give Russia a chance to avoid defeat. However, there are also specific internal deadlines because of which Putin is in a hurry and is trying to throw all his resources into the war. No one knows for sure what is really happening in Russia. He added on air at Espresso. According to the diplomat, Russia currently produces three to four times more ammunition and basic weapons than the Americans and Europeans combined. However, the situation is gradually changing. The US and EU have allowed their defense companies to reduce their capacity. However, the situation is actually starting to change. Now, for example, German defense companies are noting that they must produce more ammunition and weapons, whereas before this was a political taboo. Gradually, American and European factories are starting to produce more weapons. Breiser concluded, The Telegraph recently wrote that a vulnerable Putin is waiting for Trump to give him back the occupied territories. Politico reported that Trump and Putin are bargaining over how much Ukrainian land Russia can keep. Harold James, a professor of European studies at Princeton University, believes that Donald Trump's defeat in the presidential election could ruin Putin's plan for Ukraine. At the same time, military and political observer Alexander Kovalenko believes that Trump can provide more significant support to Ukraine than Biden. According to him, Donald Trump is a vain, narcissistic person, and if he wins the election, an unprecedented historical prospect will open up for him to become one of those presidents who would be involved in a victory on the level of World War II and even in the context of confrontation.